The GTA Online is a game with hundreds of thousands of possible items that players can consider buying at any given time, and not all items are created equally in this game. Some are bound to be better in investments than others are. And, and, and this naturally means that GTA Online players will have to prioritize certain items more than others. Fortunately, in this video, I'll show you the five best possible items every GTA, GTA Online player can buy. So let's get into it. And coming to number five, we have the nightclub. And now the nightclub is a business that gives play players a good source of passive income, which is up to 50,000 every 48 minutes. And that's especially how helpful considering that gamers will always have something to do in the game. However, it's not the sole reason to get the nightclub. Purchasing the nightclub also will give you the uh, required to get the terabyte, which in turn can is required to give the oppressor mark to homing missiles, you, you know, all the upgrades. And given how broken that vehicle is in for PvP and PvP, and the nightclub property is definitely one of the best pro properties that you can buy but before you buy it you have to mi mi make sure that you own almost every single business in in the game once you own all of those you're going to be able to link them to your nightclub and, and then you're going to make money i also have a video on this i'm going to leave it in, in the description which basically ex explains the uh, nightclub business in in like six minutes coming at number four we have any bulletproof vehicle it doesn't matter if the player goes for the um, Duke of Death or an Armored Kuruma or the Insurgent, as long as you have at least one or two bullet bulletproof vehicles that can pr protect you from the NPCs, from players even. And there will be some situations where the players can get realistically dodge, realistically dodge every single bullet in coming to them. And based on pure skill alone, and hence it's highly advisable that GTA Online players purchase any bulletproof vehicle, be something that's bulletproof, like the armed Kruma. And coming at number three, we have apartments. Now, now, apartments are definitely buying an apartment before rushing to a horde of bunch unnecessary st stuff is like investing in a small business before releasing a Ferrari. And this logic is simple because buying an apartment offers you the best return on investment ever and why is that you may ask well basically users can only do the uh and you can do the heists by owning an apartment it has to be a high-end apartment and nothing else all you have to do is just buy one high-end apartment and then you can start all the og heights and also profit and the cheapest apartment can cost you anywhere from eighty thousand. and the most expensive one is it should be around 1.1 million it has to be a high end apartment so the 80 thousand apartment is not w worth it because you cannot do the heist with you have to buy the del Perro, which is around 200 000, which is the cheapest high end apartment and then you can start doing the um the heists and coming to number two you have the bunker a bunker basically serves for several purposes and it's absolutely a must-have for a beginner in GTA Online. The bunker basically allows players to do specific achievements and run illegal arms tra trafficking operations in, in the gun running business. In GTA Online, bunker is also one of the best important things you can buy. It can serve as a personal quarter, a gun locker, a shooting range with a few easy customizations. All I have to do is just you buy the bunker from the maze bank foreclosures. Then you go to your bunker, you do setups, and you can also generate anywhere from 50,000 to 70,000 per hour. That depends on your upgrades and if it's also in double money and double speed, etc. Like we had a couple weeks ago, which was, I think, three times production and money. So yeah, that means it, gener it generates income quicker. And coming to number one, we have the Kasatka. The main reason to buy a Kasatka in GTA Online is to start one of the best heists in the game. Which is the Cayo Perico heist. This heist is definitely one of the best money makers for solo players, but I mean, it has been nerfed a lot. It's still good, but there are a lot of nerfs on it, so I'm not sure if, if it's considered the best anymore. But a lot of people, but a lot of people still play it. You should not really rely on exploits, or specific event weeks at worst, and and you can just do earn at least not 900,000 every time you do the heist to 1.5 million. That depends on what you get during the heist. Most players can understand the efficient tricks of the heist and, and its preparation missions. They can easily earn millions of dollars every day and the amount of money one can earn fr fr from this investment is it's subjective. It depends on what you get and how much time you spend doing the heist and how many times you do it. Uh, the Kasatka is also considered a vehicle and is a catalyst for being a general money maker in, in all GT Online which new players they, they should keep in mind that much of the new content in this game is ridiculously expensive meaning that they have to find great ways they can make money and keep and keep up to date if you guys enjoyed the video make sure you like and subscribe really helps the channel out i love you all very much and, and also make sure you check out this video it's gonna be about the five best solo businesses that you need in gta online so make sure you click, you click in one two three